I'm Bill Bro, and this is Kidney Cancer News. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration has granted lenbatinib, a multiple receptor tyrosine kinase inhibitor breakthrough therapy designation for investigational use in patients with advanced or metastatic renal cell carcinoma previously treated with a VEGF-targeted therapy. The prognosis for these patients is poor, with a five-year survival rate ranging from 5 to 10 percent. FDA breakthrough therapy designation was established in 2012 to address unmet medical needs in the treatment of serious or life-threatening conditions. In other news, Bristol-Myers Squibb says a late-stage trial of its drug Optiva was stopped early after the immunotherapy was found to be effective in patients with the most common form of kidney cancer. The drug maker says the study was stopped after an independent data monitoring committee concluded it provided a survival advantage over the cancer drug Everolimus. Shares of biotech company Exalexis Incorporated surged almost 50 percent in pre-market trade early this week after the company reported positive results in a late-stage trial of its kidney cancer drug. The company says the Phase three trial comparing cabozantinib to Everolimus in 658 patients with metastatic renal cell carcinoma met its primary endpoint. The 14th International Kidney Cancer Symposium and the Kidney Cancer Association's 25th anniversary celebration will be held November 6th and 7th of 2015 at the Miami Marriott Biscayne Bay. Information regarding registration, abstracts, and housing may be found online at kidneycancersymposium.com. And finally in the news, announcement of a meeting for patients and their families in Northern California. You're invited to join us at the Stanford Cancer Center, 875 Blake Wilbur Drive in Palo Alto, California, on August the 15th. For a meeting lasting from 8 in the morning until about 3 in the afternoon, there's no cost to attend and you can register online at kidneycancer.org. Topics to be covered include an overview of medical therapy for renal cell carcinoma, surgical management of the disease, and information about clinical trials and genomic testing. Join us again next month for another edition of Kidney Cancer News, the video news magazine of the Kidney Cancer Association.